Hello everybody and welcome to this episode of the Pixel Codex. Um, I'm your host Axel and today we're gonna do something different with our awesome nuts. This is an awesome nuts match here. Um, this is a match that was recommended to me. I mean, I'm not in this match by the way. We have V Dodge, Nojinha. Who the hell? These are bots. This is probably bots. Paulos, a good buddy of mine, uh, not your giants. And then, yeah, this was recommended to me by Three Letters Three, who said that this was a fun match. Now, I don't know what her definition of quote unquote fun is, so you get to judge. <laughs> this, is this is gonna be uh, fun either way. Because uh, I'm gonna be able to point out every mistake she does in this match and then shame her for it. Shit, the voices. And yeah, say hello to Vob the Vob. He's a ho another homie in the Pixel Codex gang. Join the Pixel Codex official Discord server, by the way. It's not much, but it's something, you know? So let's see. Let's see how this match goes. Polos, uh, dude's like the OG clunk. Dude's been playing clunk for as long as I can remember. So yeah, this is gonna be a fun one. Let's see the upgrades they've gone. Fire breath, of course, nibs. Ouch. Okay, Sag. Uh, I didn't. I don't think the Lone Star's Trinomite actually. Okay, that's good. Lone Star's Trinomite actually hit the railing because it swapped. So I don't know who the Lone Star is. A dot. Lone Star's a dot. Ooh. Wow, that was a nice there from Polo. So Lol lol lol. Three, you got wrecked. You got cocky. Oh, what's happening here? Okay, good thing. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Good track, of course. Um what we got? We got Sand Eagle here. Clunks of this gun snare, double re uh, one rank in region and boots by Raylin. Solid fist missiles by Sand Eagle. Yeah, Polos really went in with that. Uh, it, yeah, she, yeah, he did. It, it wasn't a good idea to swap him. Um, because Clunk has a really low cooldown of snare, so he's always a threat. I love Clunk. Um, anyway, let's see. The Vogue has gone double regen into range, which is, yeah, the typical star build for X. Okay, so Durple could could have definitely taken that kill there. They didn't drop down for some reason. That was sad. Pose could have uh, snared him. But yeah, it was kind of risky. So, in terms, what, what is this red and color? So, in terms of matchup, um, oh, okay. in terms of matchup, uh, the blue team is kind of lacking because of derp and clunk, both like almost derp and clunk does the same thing. Yeah, that. But that's again, I guess they proved me wrong, cause. <laughs> Durple just dropped in, so first Clunk dropped in, and they kinda let their guard down. Oh, oh, wow, wow, that was so dumb tree, that was the dumbest thing possible I've ever seen you done. Lol, lol, Ruffle, that was embarrassing. This is your idea of fun, getting wrecked? Yes. <laughs> I can see, yeah, okay. Oh, Scratch Boom indeed. How the hell did that snare even land? So, Clunk has gone one additional bite. Yep. Lone Star is pushing down. Ooh, and that's a dead Lone Star, of course, obviously. <laughs> and that's a dead Clunk. And that's what I was saying about the uh, blue team kind of having a disadvantage because both Clunk and Durple kind of do the same thing. Durple's gonna have to play either a very aggro so Clunk can drop in later or uh, he's gonna have to like... I think the best idea of Clunk would be to just build snare traps so Clunk can get in and uh, he can just... Derp can 
from a safe distance away land the nib. Silence on snare trap for nibs would be amazing. And I just realized that uh, three had three has gone um, darkened stone. Oh, nice, nice. That's what I was saying. I, uh, both of them dropping at the same time would be good. One drop down and the other drop down. That's how they, it should have been. Okay, good stuff. Hmm, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of getting weird Deja Vu vibes right now. How or why? I, I have no idea. I feel like I did. Oh, oh no. Okay, that was close. Does Clunk have AoE? No, Clunk goes follow missiles. I normally don't go homing missiles on Clunk. But yeah, it's, I guess it's a good budget upgrade. Wow. Wow, dude. Right now, these guys are getting wrecked. Holy shite. So, yeah, I think the problem for Nibs build is uh, simply. Wait, what? Even hallelujah with this call bird. I thought there was someone between the turn. As long as Polos got uh, yeah that it's fine. Sand Eagles knows what he's doing apparently. Ooh. Dead yeah. Dead Polos, definitely. Dead snips, definitely. Dead Lone Star, no, because she's uh, baby Baba Zina doesn't have snipe. Wow. Also, I'm sweating by the way. I, I turn the fan off every time I record and it's unbearable. For me at least. I like, I like freezing to death. Ooh. Get out, get out, get out. Ooh, close. That was so close. One more A and he'd be done. Actually, no. Lone Star is 69. I guess one more A and he'd have... Uh, Durple would have, would have had uh, 1 HP. Does he do 69? 75, never mind. He would have died. I guess at level 6, yeah. <laughs> what was that orb sound? <laughs> I feel like a balloon just like, you know. Ooh, beautiful. Durple is not afraid to really get in there. Three. Three, you're showing right now. <laughs> you're showing right now. And as nibs. She had to go, uh, what you call, piggy bank, which is the saddest thing. I really do not like to go piggy bank at all, ever. Oh, sorry, Shiny. Oh, that is not a dead clunk. I'm um, sorry, Shiny, I'm still recording. Let's see what's, what's gonna happen. Seven minutes into the game. Two levels uh, difference between the blue and red team. Uh, blue being obviously level 8 and red 6. That's also a good tactic, you know. The Holy moly! Yeah, red has gone range because. Well, I didn't even see red in the map. That range is amazing. Oh, that's a dead niche. No, that's a dead. No. Okay. Close. So Lone Star had gone, yeah, Boots. I do believe Boots is amazing against. Uh... <laughs> I can say a thousand things right now. Okay, so all jokes aside. Oh, okay. I'll give it. I'll give it. I'll give that to you. That's nice. That was a nice uh, orb to avoid this night. Good timing. Good timing. Go in, why not? Clunk wasn't there. So yeah, bull damage, that is I do believe that's amazing. Health pack on the bull. This is like my greatest uh, recommendation for Lone Star Bull. Uh, I've seen people go like cooldown on bull and health pack, but I do believe the damage is way more like, viable. You know, in the long run. Um, yeah, so I was about to say, all jokes aside, Nibs build 
Max region, yeah, I definitely agree. If you were going to go, I don't know why I would have, why we would go uh, Dark and Stone first because you're not getting Max Frenzy all the time, and even with like after exiting the orb, maybe get that upgrade first and then grab. Uh, oh, whoa, what's happening? Okay, Berlin was at the wrong place at the wrong time. I don't know what she was thinking. Don't don't teleport, yeah. Oh my lord, you did. <laughs> why would you even do that? Get back, whoa. Yes, Neebs, go, 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 go in, go in. Neebs, go in. Just, oh, never mind. So, what do we got? <clears throat> oh, dead. Never mind, he starts him, never mind. So, what I do believe that uh, would be great, you know, a way of initiation for the red team would be X swapping one person. Don't start saving the bull. Oh, yeah. And, uh, yeah, don't start saving the bull and, uh, wait, Raylan is, yeah, Raylan is down there. I think if she stays, no, okay, she teleported, smart. Uh, anyway, I, I, why am I trailing off? I always forget to say what I'm, wow, um, what I was trying to say, like, three times before, oh my god, that was, that's, that is a scary place to be in, right be between a clunk and a derpel. Uh, anyways, again, he like, I was, that's the fourth time I trailed off. I was gonna say, uh, Nibs should have gone range on fire breath. Uh, maybe shield on fire breath, but damage over time is a must in my opinion. Uh, I know you're, you know, the damage is falling off if you don't need that. But yeah, see? Maybe a one rank in damage, no shield. Yeah, okay, good, 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 good trade, good trade. Definitely worth it. Raiden is upstairs, she's gonna teleport back, yeah. That's a dead jump turret. Um, four nibs, yeah, range, damage over time, and damage, you know, increased damage on fire breath. Or shield on fire breath, uh, damage on fire breath, and damage over time on fire breath. Which would, like, you know, give them. A, be a bit more tanky than she already is because you are either gonna eat a nuke from Clunk or a nuke from Derp or, or a snipe from Ray. Those are three big burst damages. Holy shit! That was sad. That was really sad. Okay. Oh no. Wait. How did. Wait, wait, wait. wait. So, didn't he have Hey eh? uh, AoE? No. Okay. He didn't have AoE, so I think uh, if Clunk had gone AoE, could be. I do believe it would have killed the Vogue, right? If Clunk had AoE. I love AoE on anything. Yeah, get back. Um, what the blue team re needs right now is good synergy with Rift, and they're. Like set for life. <laughs> it's mid game and one like one triple kill. Good. You're cornered. What? What are these voice lines? You're not cornered. Does Ray know the definition of being cornered? So let's talk about Lone Star builds. So Lone Star had gone health pack. I would have uh, recommended going slow on bull and explode or big bull. Big bull. I honestly. Oh shit. Okay, that was well played by Polos. I guess he read. Oh wow, that was beautiful. You know, I would have never done that. You know, just be like hallelujah with. Oh, oh my lord, that is why you gotta love this Polos. <sighs> amazing, absolutely amazing clunk there. He's one of the, like the most aggressive clunks ever. And if he dies, he dies by uh, while taking others down with him. Amazing, you never underestimate a clunk. Also, plus 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 respect for playing uh, clunk all this time in a meta where clunk is. Um, Hard countered by more than half the flipping roster. So how did come out there? Solution, my friend. 
Oh, nice. Actually, that was a nice win by 3. She knew uh, that Hunt was gonna be aggressive, no matter what. And, oh, that's a dead Rainy. Please tell me that's a dead Rainy. No, sad. Ooh, nice swap by Wob. So, Wob, do you have, uh, let's see, does he have, yeah, speed boost, yeah. With speed boost, he could just, oh, that's a dead uh, Rayleigh. Don't know what she was thinking there. Speed and range on orb, slow. That's a dead bottom current, I do believe. If Funk can get in there by time. Funk can definitely take a double kill here. Okay, no. Only one kill. Sad, that was sad. It was like a do or die situation. You know? Oh no! That is it, people. Oh, sad. Shit just turned. Oh, for the blue team, it just completely went upside down. It's just, you know, they kind of turned the tables on. I guess that's game. Alright, so a lot to be said in this game. It was, it certainly was, I guess, <laughs> fun. Uh, it was fun to watch, at least. Getting, uh, you know, three getting wrecked, doing some really bad decisions. Uh, Lone Star wasn't, yeah, okay, jeez. Lone Star wasn't the best at all. Um, Lone Star's bulls could have done wonders with uh, slow. Yeah, even uh, the increased health on bull upgrade would have been amazing. Damage definitely and slow. I don't. Uh, yeah, this causing two hundred explosion damage. That's okay, but the health pack thing, I don't really agree. Just go uh, life steal and double regen, and even maybe bury a magazine. Right? Because why not? If you have life steal, I don't even. Yeah, man. There may be a cooldown on, uh, you know, every hit with your blasts will reduce the cooldown of Tritomite and then lifesteal and then damage on Tritomite and don't go regen at all, maybe go boots and bury magazine and pills, that would make you uh, Lone Star a lot tankier. And yeah, Lone Star Blade, uh, so the Vob, the Vob I, I didn't really saw, so, like, see many aggressive plays with X, but he was there at the right time and the right place and that led to some amazing kills. Double region, range, boots, increased damage on thing, recipes, boots, yeah, yeah, great upgrades. Uh, honestly, I would have gone uh, Prismatic Moonstone does first, uh, range second and double region and boots, and then damage. Uh, but this is viable as well. Crystal leaves, I should go this early on, I guess because it's actually pretty good. Uh, Durple. Increase, oh, what is this? Puss, Puss, <laughs> Puss again, album reduces side damage taken during siege mode. Um, sure, I guess. I don't see many people going that. That's actually a very expensive upgrade. Wow, 260, damn. Um, increase near duration, silence. Oh, he actually went silence uh, late game. That is interesting. I did not uh, notice that. Increase the base damage of sniper range. Yeah, full damage, sure, why not? But I do believe that the shield around Raylin when she snipes that upgrade is really really amazing um yeah just go range damage and that uh, yeah iron rifle was it if i can remember that uh, that was iron rifle increase slow on light uh, time lift attack speed and that no piercing on aa no nothing just uh, plain snipe damage clunk uh universal charger definitely amazing upgrade for especially nibs and or uh, all three of them honestly if you can just explode really fastly, they might not be able to react in time. Nibs definitely couldn't uh, react in time to some of those explodes. Bob uh, got away because of refract. Reduce cooldown time explode. Interesting. So he's gone cooldown, reducing cooldown as much explode as he wants. Uh, I would have gone reduce damage onto self, but Polos has been playing for a long, 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 long time and more games of Clunk than I've ever played. So he knows way better than me. So uh, damage uh, double and AOE. Okay, he has gone AOE late game. Mm, get an additional heal over time. I normally don't go the heal over time thing because I don't know. I feel like uh, increasing just the base damage on the snare bite is enough. But yeah. So I guess that's the game. Thanks everybody for watching, thank you 3 for recommending me this match and giving me permission to record this match. 
and um, yeah, you sucked sometimes. Mm, maybe most times than even you would have liked. But yeah, anyway, thanks so much, guys, for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to like, subscribe, do the sort of stuff, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.